I decided to train probably about, oh, it was probably about five or six years ago. I I'd, uh, just went through a bit of a cancer scare and uh, I'd come through the other side and I'd sort of thought to myself, well, you know, life's not all about riding and there was other things that I wanted to do be in life, you know, and I, was, I always enjoyed being with the horse and always enjoyed training. So um, for me, I had no hesitation in becoming a trainer. It was something that I'd always wanted to do. Obviously, it's a lot harder and there's been everybody sort of said that I was mad to do it. But for me personally, I just enjoy being around the horses. Uh, I enjoy the hard work that goes with it. And I, I love the achievement of, of seeing a horse develop from a very young age and um, grow and go to the races and be that, that mature athlete and, and win for you. You know, I knew I didn't want to ride forever. It wasn't something that I wanted to do. I, as I mentioned before, I was always probably going to train at some point in my career and, and I, we spoke in depth about it and um, obviously my family, my, my mother and father and my father-in-law and mother-in-law, they were all very helpful and, and um, give me some advice along the way. Uh, my first winner was a horse called Specific Choice, Ipswich, uh, Matthew McGilvery rode it. It was a great thrill that day, it was uh, owned by Dynamic Syndication and he was an old horse that had come up to me and he had a few convictions against his name. but. Uh, he went to he went to Ipswich and he won for us. I think he won another couple after that. So he was a, he was just a, a good old horse that um, kicked off my training. It was a great thrill, you know. He uh, as I mentioned before, he was an older horse and he uh, he'd had a few records there that uh, hadn't been so solid. But to come up here and win and race consistently, well, it was a great thrill. Stables going really well. Um, obviously, the flag bearer Boom Sara won the Magic Millions Guineas and he's a, a very very good galloper. But we've got a lot of nice young stock coming through two-year-olds from last season have just taken a little bit of time to develop they're um, they're coming along very very nicely and um, they've all been racing they've all been racing up to their ability and, and their capabilities I've got a good lot of staff there a lot of young people here but my family are involved um, my, my uh, eldest son and my daughter are here with me every morning and they do a great job they're up at 2:30, and they uh, they're here with me hands into the into the work along with my other staff they're all terrific young workers and they it's long hours for them but they um, they obviously see the rewards and, and um, they get a lot of satisfaction out of seeing the horses go on the races and, and win.